Welcome back to my channel where I inspire your desire to be great. Thank you guys so much for tuning in today. If you are new to my channel, welcome. If you are back on my channel, still welcome. Today's message for you guys. Today's message? No, before I get into today's message, one huge favor from those of you that are watching. If you haven't already, please click the red subscribe button below this video. Give this video a huge thumbs up because you know it's going to be amazing. And let's get into today's message for you guys. Today's message, today's message, today's message, today's message, today's message, today's message, today's message for you guys. Okay, I was watching yesterday's video, and after I finished uploading, I was like, oh my god, I need to do a part two to yesterday's video. Like, go more in depth, or just take something, an analogy came to my mind that I could use to bring yesterday's message to life even more. If you haven't seen yesterday's video, what are you doing? Click out of this video, go watch it, and then come back and watch this one, okay? In yesterday's video, I told you guys, do not allow waiting to wear you out and cause you to give up. And then when I watched yesterday's video and I heard myself say that, it dawned in my mind the story of the tortoise and the hare. I'm not sure, I'm not sure if most of you are familiar with this story. Most of you should be, but there is a story of a tortoise and a hare. And I'm just going to give you guys a small summary of it. The hare, he was big and he felt that he was confident in his ability to move quickly. And he challenged, he kept teasing the tortoise that he's slow, he's this, he's that. He kept pointing out the tortoise about his weaknesses. And he challenged the, t the tortoise to a race. And the tortoise took the challenge and he raced the hare. But we all know a hare is extremely faster than a tortoise. The hare decided to take a nap and go to sleep. The tortoise, slow and steady, but he won. Even though the tortoise, I mean, even though the hare is known to be faster than the tortoise. But my point of bringing up that story is, Yes, the tortoise knew he was slow. Yes, he knew the hare was faster than him, but he did not allow his ability to be slow, to wear him out and give up. So that's what I'm trying to tell you guys. Do not allow waiting. He knew it was gonna take him a long time to get to the finish line, but he had to be patient with himself and wait and take his time and get to the finish line. And that's what I want you guys to do as well. Yes, pursuing your dreams, it's going to be slow, it's going to be steady. You can't be the hare. If you become the hare and want quick overnight success and overnight result, it's not going to happen because that's not how success works. If you want to be the hare, you're not going to win, you're not going to succeed at pursuing your dreams because what happened with the hare was he was so sure of his ability that he took a nap and he fell asleep and he ended up oversleeping. Don't be so sure in your ability that you chill and you take a nap and you just you just fall back. No, but you have to be like the tortoise, slow, steady, patient, and just keep going no matter what. Keep going no matter what, because that's exactly what the tortoise did. He was, he was slow, but he was sure, and he ended up winning. And success is slow, but sure, and in the long run, you will end up winning as long as you keep going. But while you are going, don't allow waiting to wear you out. I'm sure there were times the tortoise was slow and he was wondering, where's the hare? Did he get to the finish line already? Where's the hare? Um, just worrying about, um, did, did I lose? What happened? Whatever. And sometimes you're looking at yourself and you're comparing yourself to others and saying, oh, did so-and-so get to the finish line already? Did this person do that already? But it doesn't matter what other people are doing. Focus on yourself. Stay in your own lane. 
be like the tortoise, be slow, be steady, do not allow waiting to wear you out. If the tortoise had allowed waiting to wear him out, if he was saying, you know what, I'm too slow, I'm not going to make it to the finish line, I'm too slow, I'm not going to be able to beat the hare, he would have never got to the finish line and pursued his dream of someday beating the hare that thought he was faster than him. So I'm sure you guys understand what I'm trying to say. Do not give up. Keep going. Do not allow waiting to wear you out. And yes, I am going to do a part three to this video but I will release the video tomorrow for you guys. So make sure you stay tuned and I am super excited to do tomorrow's video. Make sure you stay tuned. Like I said, click the red subscribe button below so that you can get notifications of when my videos um, are uploaded. And thank you guys so much for tuning in and watching this video. If this video has truly inspired you, like, comment, share, tell a friend to tell a friend. And if you haven't already, hit that red subscribe button that I told you to hit right below this video. And I will see you all in the next video where I inspire your desire to be great.